Well, hello, Cancer. Thank you guys so much for coming back to my channel for another day of Vlogmas. I'm going to go ahead and jump into your read, Cancer. <clears throat> see what we have for you. I'm trying to see if any cards will pop out. Uh, that wasn't, I don't really, I didn't feel that one. Let's see what we have. I'm going to go ahead and shuffle. See what we got, guys. Ooh, ooh, Cancer. I don't know what it is about me when I see like aces or the sun. Like the full card to me is almost equivalent to the aces or the sun. Like I don't know why. Because I this, this lets me know that something you guys are about to do. Um, there's something that you're about to start. Especially if you're in a stagnant energy where you're kind of like, uh, oh, nothing has happened. Oh yeah, it will be. I love it. I love that energy. Oh, yeah, something that you guys are going to be releasing, okay? This could be emotions. Um, this could be emotions. Um, this could be people, you know, like you didn't really want to because maybe you invested so much into someone. Maybe the person was cocky. And so you're walking around town like, oh, you know, everything is fine. Nothing's wrong when you're really having holding pain. Okay, so this is talking about releasing because you've been holding on to something very tightly and it's not really, mm, well, how can I explain it? It's not advantageous. Okay, not in the least bit. Okay. Ooh, so this one, okay, so this boat, they're like this. So <laughs> I couldn't turn it, I was like squeezing it to see if it was going to turn over and it didn't. Yes, you see how there's so much, so much of moving on. Because you're, you, you are going to be ending whatever process that you're doing right now, okay? You know you're about to move on. You know there are things that you are thinking about really, I mean, a lot, you know, very heavy on your heart and mind. But this energy of moving on is more, more important because you don't want to feel the sadness. Um, and you want to feel abundant. You want someone to see your worth. okay? We're going to go ahead because we're going to really get into this, but we're going to go ahead and get some more cards. And we're gonna we're gonna really get into what this read is all about. Ooh, cancer. Hmm. There is someone who wants you. And you gotta be prepared for this person coming back in. And you're used to it. You're used to this flighty energy. You're used to this person coming in and out of your life. And some of you guys are going to take this person back. That's what you're going to do. I'm going to pretend like nothing's wrong. Exactly. Because you're like, I'm doing it because I love him. I love her. I see you. And speaking of everything is fine. Man, on point. You guys have missed so many signs that this person had been doing. You, could, you guys were pretending. Let's get, let's be real. You guys were pretending that this person, you know, you, you saw the red flags. Some of you guys are not going to let this person go though, but you know how this person is coming in and out. You, you know it, you feel it. Okay. You feel every bit of it. And this person, you, you know, you want to make peace. And that's, they're going to come in saying they want to make peace. And the distance is killing you. Emotional. Not talking. That's what's really getting to you. Yeah. This person was juggling. And see, this is like, you know for a fact that this is how they are. And that's why that you're going to be in this weird decision. Because see, someone is not giving you exactly what you're giving them. They're not. But you have love for them. Some of you guys are in love with them. Okay. But are they investing in you? Are they being reciprocal towards you? And being alone for some of you is like, oh, oh, hell no. <laughs> but this is what you're facing. Okay. This is what you want. With, uh, I mean, I'm talking about when it comes down to anything, this is what you really want. You want the Ten of Pentacles. You want your family. You want the spouse. You want the dogs. You want that. And being alone is just a no-no to you. So you're like, well, let me just see. Let me just see. It has to be right. Some of you guys are going to take a risk and leave 
and you'd rather be alone for a second at least than to deal with that Knight of Wands energy. But I see it. I see what's going on here for some of you. I, I can I can feel your energy. Okay. So we're going to go ahead and get some cards here. We're going to clarify it here with a full card. Mm -hmm. I see it. Hmm. I see it now. Let's go ahead and clarify. There will be a reuniting though. And I feel like I feel like it's going to, didn't I tell you? If this person is for real, you'll know. But you're going to be faced with this. Okay. And it's going to be up to you. But again, here, the universe is saying, what lesson did you learn the last time? Trying to keep busy in order to not think about this person. When when the universe is telling you, no, stay busy. Focus on you and stop thinking so much about other things. Because there's going to be a lot of change in your life. Good change here with the Wheel of Fortune. Okay. Let's go ahead and get the chariot. I had two cards here. Oh, yeah, you're going to be very indecisive. Look, look, this again, right up under this. You don't know if you should leave or not. You don't know. You're mentally exhausted over this whole thing. This is like you just you just don't know because you have feelings for them. But you will gain clarity. Isn't that amazing how how spirit came just like that with the answer? They're like, okay, that's okay. Just go ahead and let them know that they could be indecisive all they want, but yeah, they will gain clarity. Some clarity is some clarity you don't really like because you are really sometimes the truth will be harsh and it could come from this person. Let's go ahead and get the Empress. Oh, yeah, someone is watching you and someone is coming in. I have the Knight of Pentacles and the Page, but this I feel could heal your heart or this could be the person who broke it. I'm not going to even say this is going to be a stable relationship. What I will say is that it's a potential for it, but this person has to change. Okay. Now, maybe if they've thought about it, maybe they've gained some wisdom. Maybe this has been time that has taught them. Well, you, you'll you see. You'll know. Let's go ahead and get the night of wands. Maybe this person has matured. They're no longer the knight, but the king. But still got that, you know, that uh, they still got that little player, player energy in them. Male or female. Let's go ahead and get the Queen of Cups. You're waiting. Be honest. You guys are waiting for this person. Look how much you love them. Oh, I mean, Queen of Cups everywhere here. Oh, you love them. Let's be real, Cancer. Let's go ahead and get this two of pentacles. Some of you guys have been juggling finances, and if you have, it's things are going to look up for you. Okay. There's going to be a lot of a lot of different decisions that you guys need to make as far as money, finances. So I definitely see that here. And it's very overwhelming. So I'm not going to say I don't see money or finances. I see that things will get better. It may be a little rocky for some, but it'll get better. Okay, let's go ahead and get the hermit. But as far as this person, superficial. But I feel like they're going to want a commitment here. You see how you felt like an option and it left you alone. They are choosing you, though. And look at what's at the bottom of the deck. There's going to be a new star here, clean slate. And it's possibly with someone new. You have somebody coming in. So some things you guys are just going to have to face the music on. Because remember, the Ten of Pentacles is here. That's talking about commitment. And you had the Knight of Pentacles. And it may just be with someone new. So are you willing to accept that, Cantor? But it's coming in. 
Okay. So yeah, that's what I have. It's not a bad reading. I just sensed this tug of war. Okay. Um, but everything will be okay. So Cancer, I love you guys. Okay. Um, if you are new, like I said before, please like and subscribe to my channel. I will see you guys back here again really soon. All right, guys. Bye.